baby, <laughs> million dollar baby, a baby. <laughs> Tommy Richmond, I hate that f- song. <laughs> What's up everybody and welcome back to another episode. Please like the video and subscribe. Our target is only a thousand likes. So Tommy Richmond has been dominating the charts this year with his breakout hits Million Dollar Baby and Devil Is A Lie. Amidst all the wins, he's made it clear that he doesn't want to be put in a box as just a hip hop artist. So after Joe Biden caught wind of the back and forth between Tommy Richmond and DJ Head on social media, he had a few thoughts of his own about the whole situation. Tommy Richmond's post read, I'll say again, I'm thankful for everything. I'm saying I don't want to be boxed in. I grew up on hip hop. But I'm a singer. DJ Head responded by saying, Glad I got the PSA before I did my radio mix. I now have two open slots. What should I play? Biden is not upset with the fact that he doesn't want to be positioned as a hip hop artist. He reinforced the idea that shutting out hip hop after hip hop was the main culture that embraced him is off putting to fans. Artist <laughs> Tommy Richmond. Oh boy. Another one, but I'll shut up because I complain about everybody. One of y'all, if you one of y'all. Another leave, one, what? Huh? Because I might be on the same boat with you. Another one of them. I don't know how to say it. Another one of those. Culture vulture? I'm not going to call him that because he's worked hard. He has music. He's been working on music for a long time. This is my thing. And let me tell you what he said first. So we, before, I got the tweet up. Before we kick us back in. All right. Go, go ahead then, girl. Uh, So Tommy Richmond, he posted a tweet on October uh, 2nd. He says, um, I'm not a hip hop artist. There we go. Duh. duh. Do you guys know who he is? Yes. Yeah, you got that million dollar baby. I ain't never been a strange babe. I do you want, I just want to make love in the day. Million dollar baby. A baby. Million dollar baby. A baby. Dead wrong. I'm in the city that's so damn strong. In the winter, babe. I just want to make love. You know all the words? You a baby. Million dollar baby. A baby. Tommy Richmond. I hate that fucking song. Word, that shit is disgusting. I didn't hate it at first, but mm-hmm. I've heard it enough. I hate that song. I needed to hear more slaps. Tommy Richmond, because there's a lot of money behind him now, he got some more slaps. Mm-hmm. But Tommy Richmond came out and said, I'm not a hip hop artist. To which DJ Head of Elliot Wilson's show with Jeremy Heck, white boy learned to name, look at that. <laughs> D- DJ Head says for show. So every hip hop station playing Million Dollar Baby or Dow should stop today. Thanks for the heads up. Um, to which Tommy Richmond thought long and hard about mm. and replied and said, uh, I'll say again, I'm thankful for everything. I'm saying I don't want to be boxed in. I grew up on hip hop, but I'm a singer. Publicist. What Joe Damn Budden says me. is, nigga, say that. Then. Word. Say that. No, I'm not a hip hop artist is what he meant to say. After the backlash, your publicist calls you and said, you fucking dodo. So now we got to clean it up. Or and because you or, are, I, I, I don't. I disagree with that. I think he was saying I'm not just hip hop. Or don't. Well, he had call. to clean it up I by had, saying that. Say just I get it. But yeah. again, this is social media. You don't. It, you hit send and it's out to the millions immediately. No, to the Almost. people that don't have a team of however many people working on their presentation that he has. and Correct. their social media. Correct. But but for, they still for regular they people. Camera. We get on and say shit and then don't mean it and yada yada yada. For him, who you've been busting your ass to break through, didn't do it for whatever reason. Mm -hmm. And then you've got Million Dollar Baby and then black people and then TikTok and then culture Mm -hmm. pushed you to where you needed to be. Mm -hmm. Now is not the right time for I'm not a hip hop artist. I have no problem (laughs) with I'm not just a hip hop artist or I'm much more than just a hip hop artist. Or shut the fuck up and enjoy your wave. You don't have to address that what you are to nobody. Yeah, why are you even tweeting? What are we talking about? We don't. Yeah. Why are you even tweeting? Ah, All you got to do, you got the easiest job in the world, Tommy Richmond. Shut the fuck up. Dog. You in that group, let me get my shit off Go ahead, first. Rock out, bro. You in that group of people that can receive your success and never have to talk to black True. people. A thousand percent. Mm-hmm. A thousand percent. But when the first time you speak, Speaks to the years and because I don't think there's nothing wrong with what he said in terms of you. You're not. A I, don't, I don't. I look at him as. Have you I don't, not, I don't, you don't look have at to you say as that. a hip hop artist either, nigga. You did not have to say that, but you saying it when hip hop is who have, has broken you and accepted you. 
it gives us remnants of all of the white acts who their barrier of entry is hip hop and they and then, Use then they abandon it and they throw it to the side and then they start doing country folk music and act like that shit never happened. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Tommy Richmond ain't fire enough to do that yet. Sorry. Mm-mm. I agree with Sorry. you. Sorry. Now, he did clean it up. Thank you, DJ Head. Thank you, Tommy Richmond, for not sounding as stupid as we thought you were about to sound. Let me ask y'all something. And we again, we've seen artists do this just out of frustration. I'm just giving a, another possible scenario. He do an interview, he, he article something, and they're labeling you a hip hop artist. And it's just like, damn, dog, yo, I'm not a hip hop artist. Not the shit on hip hop. And again, you might not realize that because you're not of the hip hop culture. I don't want to hear that what, shit. Can I, he, can, I, can, I, can I please finish? Yes. I, I waited. Mm. He, don't do that. I'm sorry. Thank you. I'm sorry. Because you sorry. know what they're going to start their shit. Oh, I'm sorry. I appreciate it. I didn't I'm letting everybody cook. Right? I just, okay. just want to cook too. Go, go. Your stove what you cooking? Is small. <laughs> it's okay though. It, 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 the, the meal, the, it ain't about the size of the stove, it's the meal. <laughs> it's the meal. <laughs> That's the middle. I've chefed it up on a, I've chefed it up like, on a hot plate before. Okay. One plate. Go ahead. <laughs> but nah, like sometimes people, he's not of the culture, so he might not even understand that that st- that statement, how it's gonna resonate to people. Why people might take it that way. It could literally have been, yo, dog, I'm just please stop calling me hip hop. I'm but, not hip hop. But, to but jo- now once you realize that, mm-hmm. I have to clean that up. But to Joe's point, he has this huge team. So And he's white. Yes, and so they should be cognizant of the fact that Is making it, a statement like that will be inflammatory a, to the hip hop community. Well, why not just say that in an interview where you can expound on it? Exactly, not Instead a tweet. Of a tweet. Oh, why say it, period? Well, that I just told you how many times that we've seen people say things in the moment out of frustration, and now you have to deal with the fallout. I could see it in an interview situation where someone's asking about hip hop shit, and he's like, "What's well, so the conversation?" I don't yeah, want to be close minded mm-hmm. to that. Yeah. That is possible. That's what I'm just giving a. But alternative, there's more gravity to the mistake than, than yes. you know it to be. True, and he it's, might he's learning that the conversation is deeper than, hey, you guys, y'all got me grouped in as hip hop, but I'm not hip hop. The conversation and the waves, mm-hmm. the dog whistle that it sends mm-hmm. is mm-hmm. much deeper than, yeah, because you, you could easily the, say, y'all, I love like, hip hop, I grew up on hip hop, but I don't really consider myself a hip hop artist. Like, you could I, somebody, do it in a way that's somebody nice. on his team is supposed to let him know, hey, that they broke you. Hey, dummy, you might get nominated for a Grammy. You have one of the most popular songs in the Probably country will. this year. Mm-hmm. You're going to get nominated for a Grammy. If they nominate you in the best hip-hop song category Take or the it. best hip-hop that, album, you, want you don't want to turn that off? You want that yeah. at all? No, it's true. I was just what speaking to about? just giving him some, shooting him some bell just on the intent of it. He might. I don't think he intended to shit on hip-hop or to disrespect hip-hop. That was all. I don't know him. That's true. I'm not, I'm not, not, not going to put that on him. I don't know him. I, I don't know. I can't say if it, that was his intent or not. You're right. Would you guys hip hop no. though? No. I wouldn't. What is hip hop today? Mm, true, point. true. But that it half that shit, half yeah. half of the shit today. Yeah. If a hip hop artist that we know and love put that song out, we wouldn't say it wouldn't wasn't blink. It wouldn't bat an eye at it. Facts. 